Hey guys, Huck Sports Cards here. Hope everybody's having a blessed day. Well guys, we're gonna do a PSA reveal today. Uh, I already know the grades. Uh, got some good ones, got some bad ones. Uh, but I have a mixture of stuff in here. I've got some uh, 1952 tops. Uh, a couple of them are high number cards. You guys know how hard that is to uh, to find the high number cards. Uh, so I've got a couple of them graded and uh, I think I got about six or seven of the 1952 Topps Baseball graded. And I got some other stuff, some 1978 Topps Basketball. So, uh, but guys, uh, let's go take a look and uh, see what I got on my grades. All right, guys, I'm gonna show you uh, those 1952 Topps Baseball, but I wanted to show you this one. Uh, if you watched uh, some of my other videos, you saw this car before, but uh, actually holder on the back had a scratch on it so i sent it back in no problem didn't cost me anything so i pre appreciate uh, psa doing that but guys here's uh some of the 1952s and um, as you can see this is a high number card i think the high number started with uh the mickey mantle uh it was three number 311 i believe uh but uh I mean, it's a pretty pretty nice card. Uh, I, I think I think that the the two is fair on that, and uh, also thought that the two on this one was fair and everything. Another another high number card for the fifty twos. So I was excited to get those, and uh, so here is some more fifty twos. Now these aren't high numbers. I was a little disappointed with this one, but the corner was kind of messed up, so I got a got a two and a half on that. And got a three on this one. So kind of moved up and then got a four. So I mean I was I was pleased with overall I was pleased with the grades of these 52s. And everything. I mean, I was definitely pleased with these. I thought the two was very fair for both these high number cards and everything. So definitely pleased with that. Then I also sent in some uh, couple fifty sevens, and uh, I don't know. I, I was a little disappointed. I was I was thinking six on this, you know, but uh, got a five, and I think this is a. Uh, Rocky Calavito's rookie card, if I'm not mistaken, and uh, got a five on that. Which you can see it's off center from top to bottom and uh, left to right. So, I mean, I guess a five is, is fair with this one and everything. Now, here's two of them that I, were, I was definitely disappointed with. Uh, I definitely thought both of them would get fives. Uh, I know there's a little bit of corner wear on the Brooks Robinson, the top left, but I still thought it was going to probably get close to a five. Um, you know, thought it was going to get a five, but, you know, I could see maybe that one getting a four, but this Rod Carew, I, I just thought it was really nice, and I thought it definitely a, a five on that. So, and then... Um, also got this uh, Mike Smith, 76 tops. Got an eight on that. So I was definitely happy. Now the rest of these are basketball. And uh, I mean, some of these I was very disappointed with. I, I really thought that most of these that I sent in would be eights and nines. I really did. And I have no idea how this this Dr. J got a five. I mean, because when I went through, I, what it was, I bought a collection, and I got this whole 1978 top set, and uh, it was in the collection, and they were really, really nice. I pulled out some of them that I thought were really nice, and um, and got a five on this one. So I'm really disappointed in this. And this Walt Frazier. I really thought that it was going to get an eight. And so once again, I was disappointed. The Pistol Pete got a seven. 
so that really wasn't too far off from you know what I wanted and everything and then this Bernard King I mean I, I swear I thought this thing was definitely an eight possibly a nine and I don't know how I got a six and everything so and then the artist Gilmore used to play for the Kentucky Colonels with Dan Itzel when I lived up in Kentucky that was a long long time ago early 70s he got this Moses Malone which I honestly I thought it was gonna be a nine uh, so just disappointed Bill Walton came back in eight now this is the one that this just blows my mind that it got a four I mean I see no possible way that that gets a four. I mean, there's no way that gets a four. I mean, the corners are sharp. I mean, I know it's off center a little bit, but not bad enough to get a four. And if you look, I, I, mean, I don't know if they thought that was a mark on the card, but I mean, that's on all the cards. So, so yeah, just I'm just kind of disappointed with these uh, overall. I mean, like I said, I mean, this Bernard King, I just, I don't understand how he got a six. So. Hey guys, well, I appreciate you watching today. Uh, like I say, had some good, had some bad. That's just the way it goes. I was happy with the 1952s. Uh, I thought that those grades were were uh, probably what they should have been. I was a little disappointed with some of the, uh, the 78s, but, you know, like I said, that's the way it goes. Uh, guys, I really appreciate you watching. Uh, guys, I hope you're enjoying uh, J.C. Lee's NFL picks. Uh, she did really good this this week. She went 9-6-1, and one, so uh, not bad for doing the spread. But, uh, but, guys, I really appreciate you, like I say, watching. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I ask that you do so. Hit those notifications. Uh, guys, until next time, we'll see you later.